I'm about to head off. I'm going to Prospect, which is 30 minutes away from where I live. Have I even told you what we're doing? No. Fucked and drank all night. Acted all alright. I mean, if you can read the title, then you know. But, um... I'm gonna do another thrifting video. It's gonna be a little bit of a twist because last time I went to Savers, which is where I'm going again, but I'm going to one that's in a different area, so it's like half an hour away from my house to kind of mix it up a bit, I guess, because I don't really wanna go to the same place again. So um, I'm gonna buy all this stuff without trying it on and then I'm gonna come home and try it all on for you. And I just wanna get some like basics and I really wanna look around and see if I can get some cool like shoes and just heaps of stuff and I'm not gonna be able to try it on before I buy it. It's kind of the plot twist, I guess, that makes it a little bit more interesting. So I'm gonna leave now. I have a feeling I'm gonna hit like peak time, but it's fine. I just arrived, sharp. I just arrived. That was probably, and I swear I say this every time, probably the most stressful drive of my life. I didn't realize how far Prospect is. Like in the grand scheme of like actual distance, it's closer than the one I normally go to, but I didn't realize that you have to go like all the way into the city and then back out. So that's why it took me so long. It took me like 45 minutes to get here. Am I really gonna do this cringy shit? <laughs> you bet you're the sweet ass I am. Goodness. <laughs> that is probably the most successful like shop I've ever had in my whole life. Far out. <laughs> Literally had to buy a bag because none of it was gonna fit in my own bag. How much did I actually spend? Um 93.88. So I got there and it was a bit like I couldn't find anything and I was stressing out because I was kind of uncomfortable as well. And then all of a sudden I was just, I was just, it was just one thing after another and I was like, I cannot have all of these. Like that's an issue. We're gonna try it all on. So, oh my God, okay. There's this bird, right? That comes outside my bedroom window and it just yells at me. And that's what it's doing right now. I really tried to get out of my comfort zone. Like, knowing me, I went straight to, like, the oversized tees. And I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. And then I, like, stopped. And I had a little bit of a moment. I had to recenter myself. And I was like, nope, we're going to put these back. This is not what I came for. And, like, the hoodies and all that, I just put it all back. Because I was like, that was not what we came for. So I tried really hard to go out of my comfort zone. And I think I did. So... This, right? It's like a knitted thing. I was thinking that I could do like what those people do, how they like cut them and then they look really cool because it's got a collar and I thought it was kind of like really unique. I could make it like a crop, I guess, which would kind of defeat the purpose of it being warm, but that's what I was thinking. It's actually really warm. It's kind of itchy, but... Yeah, that was kind of my idea behind this. I am actually gonna give this a thumbs up. We like this. She needs some altering, but we knew that. Like even if you were just to do like that, I think that's so cute. The plan was to decide between this one on that one, and then I couldn't decide. I actually put this one back and then walked away and then I walked back. So yeah, okay. Interesting. Mm, not the biggest fan of the neck, but I think. Ooh, I don't know. It's kind of cute. Probably wouldn't wear it with like a skirt, but again, could probably just tuck it in. Okay, no, I actually like this. This is cute. And it's grey. Why can't I stand? <laughs> yeah, it's cute. It's like a little roll neck sweater. Nice, nice, nice. Cute. Tie dye, and I don't own anything tie dye. So I thought it was cool and I wore it to bed. And it was only like $3. <laughs> so we'll give that one a big thumbs up. I don't actually know what it said. I thought it said cult, but I could be wrong. I don't actually know. Comment down below. <laughs> I have no idea what it says. 
I apologize for the lighting changes. The sun is like <sighs> in the process of going down. So I don't know whether to keep my blind open or shut it. So I'm just going to leave it open because there's only like a little crack of sunlight still. And then when that's gone, we'll be good. Whoa. Hold on. <laughs> I have never in my life owned or worn anything quite like this. But like, okay. She's kind of cute. I don't know. I kind of got it as a joke. I don't know. I just wanted to try something different. It's just like a plaid brown. The arms are a bit short. But I mean, if I don't do that, which you don't generally do, then it looks nice. But I don't know if I'd actually wear it. But I probably wouldn't wear it buttoned up anyway. These ones are full length, which I didn't realise I thought they were. Oh, camel toe. These like ribbed bits at the thighs. I don't know if I'll wear them, but like, they're cool. Nice. Sick. Cool. But these are not the ones that I'm excited to show you. If you don't know what ECT is, I think that's how you pronounce it. I could be really dumb. But like, these ones... And they have like this cinch in bit at the butt. So I'm very excited. So like they're full length. They actually do fit. I was wrong. They don't feel like I'm wearing anything. Which is weird. You all want to see the butt. I know. I want to see the butt as well. Ooh! Oh! That makes your butt look so good. Back thumbs up for them. Plaid pants. So they look cool, obviously not with this top, <laughs> they're full on squeezing the shit out of me. You can literally see how tight they are, they're so tight and I don't really like, I can't even lift my leg up, you can see in the mirror. I don't like the length of them, but I get the gist, I get where they're going with it just not my size the next things that I've got are all dresses which is kind of weird for somebody that doesn't really wear dresses <laughs> okay so I have a vision for this dress what I want to do with it is like make it short that would be really cute I think maybe take it in but I don't know if I even again this is a lot lighter of a yellow than it's showing on camera but like in reality it's actually this long and I'm just not a long dress gal but I also think my mum would look really nice in this like if I don't keep it then I think she would look really cute in it so yeah that one's kind of like a unsure number this is the next one um okay so <laughs> I don't like this fit. This fit's a bit dumb. Like there's a split and they make it. It's a good length and everything. So the reason why I thought I would like this is because I have this dress, which is like pretty much exactly the same. And I love this dress. So I thought they're kind of the same. Like they've got the same style, I guess. So that's why I thought I would like this. I just don't like the bit at the front that does that. But, like I don't hate it, because it is a bit granny. Bit granny for me. But I'm sure it would look cute on someone. My camera just stopped recording because I ran out of storage, so I had to go delete some things. But this dress is beautiful. Like, it's actually stunning. Like, it's so gorgeous. I had a feeling I was gonna love this dress. <laughs> I think if I were to go to like a wedding or like, I don't know, something where I need to like look pretty, then I would wear this. I think this is like beautiful and it fits me like perfectly. I'm in love and the green is so nice. And this is the last one. <sighs> I really like this dress, I'm not going to lie. It's really pretty, it's flattering, and it's comfy, and it also was brand new when I bought it. So, 
The only issue is the length. Like, personally, I would, I think I might take it up as well because I do actually really like it. I would like it to be like that length. Just a personal preference. But I really freaking like it. I think it's so cute. Roll the outro. That is the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was something a little different, but I really enjoyed filming it, even though it took majority of my day today. It was kind of worth it. Because I've got so many cool things to now go in my wardrobe. So yeah, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up and comment down below what you want to see in the future and subscribe if you want.